Uh, number two, we should be praying for our deceased relatives and oh. friends. This is really important. Actually, the death of someone doesn't mean that maybe it's the end of all everything. No. When Allah is speaking about us in Surah Al-Hashil, verse number 10, I'm trying to defend the du'as for departed friends and relatives. You're you know, trying to defend? Yes. Why defending? Because, because whenever we pray for them, Allah forgives us. Mm -hmm. If you grant me like two minutes. So, so when you say I'm trying to defend, yeah. it means someone else is not. Yes. This is what mm. I, I said in the first place. Mm. Today, among we Muslims, even someone with your sound knowledge, your sound knowledge, these first books, mm. wants to issue a ruling that, you know, this is bidah, this is the... No. Islam is about contemplating and learning. Actually, Prophet Muhammad says, Searching for knowledge is mandatory upon we Muslims. You understand? Upon him, my Muslim brother so, and so, my so Muslim some sister. Some people or some yes, they do bash these scholars. Do yes, some they scholars disregard. This. Yes, they okay. said these are innovation is created mm. by some Muslims. Did we said no. Number okay. one, mm. when Allah says whatever Allah says is a command, and we mm. should be contemplating on that amr, on that command. Okay. When Allah is trying to guide us to show us, Allah does not speak about something, and uh, at that same time is applauding that action, and that same time. He doesn't want us to do that action. In Surah al hashid verse number 10, he says that uh, those be people, those brothers who come after, okay. you understand? Mm -hmm. They pray for themselves and they also pray for those departed ones mm -hmm. who were first to believe in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Therefore, whenever we pray for these respected people, okay. the, dis uh, the, uh, the respected the departed see, friends mm -hmm. and uh, relatives, they do hear some people say, you know, those people, whenever you pray for them, they don't perceive. But we say they perceive. Mm. In the Quranic chapter 3, Surah Imran, verse number 169 to 170, Wala tahsabanna alladhina qutilu fi sabili Allahi amwata. Don't perceive those killed or passed away while believing in Allah's word that maybe they don't perceive everything. No, they perceive and they are enjoying Allah's blessings. My point is, whenever we invoke supplications okay. to these people, these prayers benefit them. And the due process, because they're in purgatory world, in mm. Barizakh, mm. they also pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala okay. to bless us who are still existing. Okay. That Allah bless those people yeah. so that they can be in place to always pray for us. Number two, another legality mm. for praying for these departed.